Miss Sharma, my lord. Oh. Good night, my lord. Can you ever just agree? If you say you feel that feeling. Feeling? Could you not see? The one that makes it impossible for you to look away from them at any given moment. You're the bane of my existence. And now you question my judgment. Only because you question mine. The two of you cannot seem to stay away from one another. Because she is aggravating. When you then looked at me. You looked at me. Not in the way that you did. How exactly did I look? When all you are able to do in their presence is to fight the urge to lean forward and and touch their lips with yours. Tell me. Goodbye. Your silence is an indication we're reconsidering your declaration. Is that what you want for me to reconsider? Do you think that there is a corner of this land that you could travel to far away and free me from this torment? It is maddening. It is not part of what I want. I do not think that is true. How much you consume my very being. My father raised me to act with honor, and that honor is hanging by a thread that grows more precarious with every moment I spend in your presence. Are the young ladies of London truly so easily won by a pleasing smile and absolutely nothing more? Do you find my smile pleasing? Are you going to ask me to dance? All I find myself thinking about, all I find myself being able to breathe, is you. Feeling that place is so it would pass. Your opinion of yourself entirely too high. It's making me reconsider everything I've ever told myself. Allow me. Do not lose her, Anthony. I, can't tell I love you. I've loved you from the moment we raised each other in that park. I've loved you at every dance. On every walk, every time we've been together, and every time we've been apart, you don't have to accept it, you don't have to embrace it. Or even allow it, knowing you. I, I do not need you to ask me anything at all. Kate! I know I am imperfect, and I will humble myself before you, because I cannot imagine my life without you, and that is why I wish to marry you. Well, you do not vex me. Is that a promise?